What is this guy doing then? What is that guy doing then? Alright boys and girls, welcome to this week's video. Now today, I'm going to be driving on my own for the first time ever. I've, I've, well, ever. I've been out with my mates because the first time I, I passed my test I was so gassed, I just went out. But on camera, I've owned it, this is my second time going out. And today, you're going to join me on my first drive on camera. But yeah, let's not waste any more time. We've got the GoPro set up. And let's go for a drive. First of all, obviously, a class driver, you know how they drive. So let me just, you know, get my seating to the appropriate position. Hold on. There we go. I can touch the steering wheel. I can see out the windscreen, see the sky. That's all you need to look at when you're an A-class driver. You don't need to see anyone else. Right. We're out. We're freaking out on my own. This feels so weird. It feels so weird. I'm on my own now. <laughs> what the hell? But this enables me to do so many more things with YouTube as well. And that's what I'm actually really excited about. I can do anything I want now. I can go anywhere. Stay there, Peugeot driver. Thank you. All right, we're going to be going on some pretty insane roads today. All right. If I was a one series driver, I'm not using the indicators. But obviously, a respected A-class driver uses their indicators, one series drivers. Oh, what is this? This is so tight. Oh my god. Oh my god, this is not tight enough for two cars. What do you mean? This is quite a nice road. When do you get past? You mean bloody kayaking in the rain? What is wrong with the man? Oh, oh what are these ramblers doing? Get on the curb. See, I'll rate them. Thank you very much. I'll say thank you to them. You know, you get them twats that just stay on the road and they're like, they expect you to go around when there's oncoming cars. Idiots, but they, they're nice people. I can appreciate them. This is a well nice road though. And what's great about it, this car is so slow, you can literally pin your foot to the floor 24 7 and you're not even doing over the speed limit. So what did you guys have for breakfast today? I had some Weetos. Oh, driving is so nice, especially on a road like this. Jeez. So this road's 60. And it's like... For me in this, it takes so long to get to 60. Like, I think it's like 11 or 12 seconds, this car. There's not enough time to get there. I mean, I get there in the end, but then by the time I get there, there's a corner. This is really bad of me. I'm already looking at new cars. Is it not? Surely it's not just me that does that. They get a new car and then they're already looking for the one after, like within a week. Yeah, I'm not going down there, mate. Workforce in road. Oh my god. You're joking. You're actually taking the piss. I saw that as soon as I turned on here. For God's sake. What the hell? It's a Chrysler limo. <sighs> Fat people love to drive little cars. Or is it just me? Like... Why? You know when you do your driving test, they make you do like... Check your mirrors every time you indicate. Like... Little things like that, like check your mirrors every two seconds. Like, Why do you have to do that? You look in your mirror once, you see if there's someone there or not, and you know they're there. Why do you have to look in your mirror every five seconds to be like, oh, they're still there, they're still there, they're still there. Where the f*** are they going to go? They're going to go for a picnic on the side of the M25. Like, who's going to do that? We're out. We are out. What do you mean? We're out, boys. Freedom! Let's go. See you later. Oh, can I just say, yeah. One thing that I, I've never understood with driving right never understood it with like your lessons your tests and stuff feeding the wheel but why why do we do it i know that the reason behind it as in 
if you cross your arms, then if the airbag goes off, the airbag goes into your arms, which then pushes into your chest or whatever, or some shit like that. I think that's one of the reasons. Another reason is that it's because it's safer. You have more car control, but it's such a rough, like, the way you turn. You're, like, turning, like, you know, you know when you drive on xbox with a controller on any driving game and you just jag like you're all like that's what it's like when you're steering like feeling not like no why i just never understood it honestly it's stupid all right how are we gonna get out of here then because it's pretty busy i won't lie Gonna have to push our way out. There we go. And we're out. If you guys like the driving videos, like this style of video, leave a like down below. And also comment. Is it a thing? Just comment something. It just helps the video out. Oh, what are these guys doing? Get out of the road. Do you know one thing that's well annoying, right? When bicycle people decide to bicycle on the road, yeah, but there's a cycle path just next to the bloody road, like it's literally, you can see it and they're like, nah. It's always the ones that like suit up and like think they're an Olympian. It's always them. I think we're on the, right, up here, yeah, there's a turning, right? And you don't realise it's a turning until you're at the turning, or you know the road. Like the first time I came along, yeah, you come, up, you'll see, yeah, you'll come up to it and you'll be like, "Oh, it's just a road." But no, like I almost pulled out the first time, just because I thought it was the road carrying on. And then all of a sudden, it's like, "Jesus!" And I had to slam on the brakes. But like, look, look, look at this, right? You're coming, yeah, and then you don't realise because it's on a brow of a hill. You don't realise it's a road to like here. And at that point, if you're like going quick, you're absolutely finished. Alright, we're almost here boys, we're almost here boys! Let's turn left up here, yeah. Oh, they're going straight as well. Hopefully there's not many people up here. I mean, it's raining, so... But, this is the road. Now tell me this isn't a sick road when you see it. So nice. 60 mile an hour speed limit as well, so I ain't even getting close to that. What is this guy doing then? What is that guy doing then? Fucking idiot. On my side of the road. Even the cyclist was like, that was stupid. Look at this road. Look at it. What do you mean? Oh. I've chosen a bloody brilliant day to come out, haven't I? There's a lot of standing water. Look at this, so nicely paved as well, it's so smooth. one camera down hopefully you enjoyed the video if you did leave a like and subscribe that would help the video out a lot and uh, yeah if you want to see more driving videos like this put down what type of driving videos you know put down below what you'd like to see me do with the car any modifications where you'd like to see me go or different types of driving videos you know so put that down below and uh, yeah hopefully you've enjoyed this video because I certainly have enjoyed making it first ever driving video it's been it's been fun but um there is a lot of cyclists jesus christ but yeah that is going to be it for today uh yeah thanks for watching no 
Now the workout gets back up again. I love electric seats. Right. Smoking up a jet, oh, 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 think I don't fall into a mess.